Hey guys, it's my welcome back to X Exciting Hack XX. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how to use the fold effect um and the flip effect that Camtasia Studio has. And with this you can recreate kind of like the folding text of uh, Final Cut Pro. So yeah, this was really requested, but Fernando and I didn't know if we were going to be able to do it because we could get just like copyrighted or something. But then we realized that it was it was just a form uh to recreate it. So yeah, but basically you just want to go to Pick Monkey. Yeah, um, then go to Design design yeah sorry i spelled that wrong but then go to um the canvas color and apply it to transparent canvas and then go to the overlay section and go to geometric and apply apply a rectangle so just make it like the size that you want and just change the color how you wanted it to be but yeah, once it's like that, you just want to go and uh, just take the font of your text. So I'm just going to use Vivas New or New or I don't know. I'm just going to type like tutorial. I'm going to change the text to white. Okay, so make it bigger. A little smaller just select it and stretch it out and now go again to the overlay section and go and put another rectangle and now you can change it but I'm just going to put this bright gray color okay so I'm just going to put it kind of like in the middle Just stretch it. Okay, so now I'm just going to put it in more in the middle. Now. Like that. Okay, so I'm just going to crop it so it doesn't get blurry. Okay, so apply. I'm just going to save it. Going to put it. Save it on my desktop. And now I want to go to Camtasia and import it okay so desktop tutorial okay so now i'm going to callouts and put a rectangle and put the color to be green okay because we're going to use ccc green screen okay now go put the text so basically the effect if you put it like this just make this bigger it will fold but just to the side so if we want this to fold like up and down just wanna put it like this just make it fit and leave some some spaces on the side okay so once it's like that apply the effect okay in the beginning and on the end okay so now just select both and go to group okay so once you have it like as group you can just import your video but in my case i'm just going to import the background okay and we're going to use this as a green screen so go to this plus sign select the green go to visual properties remove a color and you just want to be selecting i don't know the green okay select it and now 
it will look like upside down so you just wanna click it and turn it around and put it where you want it to be it could be kind of like this way and it will look like this Okay, so yeah guys, that's basically it. Hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Make sure to share this with all your friends because this is like the best tutorial ever. So yeah, um, make sure to comment some video requests and that's everything. Bye!